This video is going to show you how to find journal articles here at the Steelman Library at Southeastern University. Once again, we're going to go to library.seu.edu. This time, instead of searching in the Everything box, we are going to click on the tab for Databases. When we click on this tab, it takes us to all the databases that we have at Southeastern University. For the sake of our example today, we're going to go to Education. You'll notice that it gives us both recommended databases at the top as well as other databases below that may be helpful for our searching. We're going to EBSCO. You'll see that we have the search box front and center, but before you search there, scroll on down to limit your results. We want to click on full text so that the entire article is right there on the computer, and you want to click on scholarly peer-reviewed journals. Then go up and do your search. We are doing education and leadership. The word and tells the computer that we want both search terms, but in any order. You'll see that we have 82,000 articles that are full text, meet our search, and are scholarly. It's wonderful. We're going to click on the title of the article. This gives us more information about it that we would need for our APA citation at the end of our paper. Notice on the left-hand side we do have the PDF full text and it will give you the entire article just as it appeared in the original journal. On the left hand side you can also see other articles that appeared in this same issue of the journal in case you need to compare those. Now notice on the right hand side of the screen we have some icons that can help us out here. You can print the entire article if you wish to do so. You can email it to yourself or a friend uh, don't use this yellow folder. The yellow piece of paper is to cite it and it will try and cite it in APA format. Keep in mind that all computers make mistakes. So you can see that with this one, the authors and the title of the article are in all caps, which is incorrect. You are always responsible for correcting APA even if the computer does it wrong. Okay, your professor will expect that. The other nice tool that we have here is the permalink. This permalink is a URL that will always take you or your professor directly to the article. And it's very helpful to keep this in case you need to find the article again and don't want to have to go through the entire search process. To get back to our list, we just click results list here in the right hand corner. Once you're back at the search results screen, you can continue to go down through your articles and continue to find ones that will help you. Now this one in particular, it says full text from Eric. What that means is that the full text is actually at the database that the government has. It will automatically take you to that website and the download for full text will be on the right hand side. Notice that we have the full text here. Um, you may want to save this to your computer so that you have a copy of it that you can go straight to without having to go through all the steps to get to the ERIC site. And one final thing as we look at our results list, there are occasions where even when we have chosen uh, to have the full text and we click on it, we see that it's not there. Just email us at library at seu.edu and we will get the article to you as soon as possible. Remember, do not pay for journal articles. Always ask us, email us, and we will be glad to get those for our distance and online students. Thank you.